Hello and welcome to this video on Snort Rule Conversion in the Cisco Secure Firewall version 7. In this video I'm going to quickly demonstrate how to convert your custom Snort 2 rules into rules that will work with Snort 3. We're going to start off by going to the Objects menu where you'll find the rules that we have already created for Snort 2. Under Objects Intrusion Rules I'll click on the Snort 2 All Rules tab. Easiest way to find your local rules is to go up here and go to the local rules category. So I have a number of Snort 2 rules here I've created. And what I want to do is I want these rules to be imported and converted so that they'll work in Snort 3. Because Snort 3 uses a different rule syntax. It's very similar, but it is actually more consistent, different ways to separate keywords, and uh, they are not compatible. So Snort 2 rules will not work with Snort 3. To convert those, I'm going to go over to the Snort 3 All Rules tab here. And once you arrive at Snort 3, you'll have All Rules selected, so you can just leave that there on the left. Now on the right, we have this Tasks drop down, so I'm gonna click that. So you have a couple options here when it comes to conversion. They're under Snort 2 here. In the Snort 2 heading, you have Convert and Import, or Convert and Download. You can use Convert and Download if you simply want to convert your Snort 2 rules to Snort 3 syntax and download them in a file. If you use convert and import, it's going to convert 100% of your Snort 2 rules into Snort 3, and it's going to place them into a single new custom rule group. By using the convert and download option, again, you can convert those, download them as a file, then you can re-upload those as separate files if you want, in different categories of rules. So uh, let's go over this one first. So convert and download looks like this. When you click it, you get a dialog here that explains to you that that Snort 2 rules are not auto-converted when you upgrade, and what this is going to do is, is convert those and download them. So you click OK. It will just uh, quickly convert those rules, and you'll get a file you can see down on the left called customrules.txt. Here's what the converted rules look like. It's basically a text file. You can even see some comments within the file explaining some of the changes between Snort 2 and Snort 3. At this point, your options are to simply re-upload the entire file, edit the file, maybe break it up into smaller files. To upload your converted files, go back up to Tasks, and then under the Snort 3 option, pick Upload, and then just point to the file there. Another option we have for importing rules is the Convert and Import. So again, what Convert and Import will do is just do this in one step. It will basically convert all those rules that we just saw, and then import them immediately into the local rules group. So let's see what that looks like real quick. So Convert and Import. Similar dialog to what we saw already, basically saying the same things that Snort 2 and 3 are different. This is going to convert all your Snort 2 local rules to Snort 3 rules. So click OK. Again, that conversion process is pretty quick. And it just says, OK, they were successfully imported. If we look over here on the left now, we can see we have a local rules group. We have a group called All Snort 2 Converted Global. This one rule group now contains 100% of your Snort 2 to 3 converted rules and you can now go to the policies and enable those as you see fit. That does it for this quick overview of Snort 2 to 3 rule conversion. As always, thanks for watching and happy snorting!